Saturday. It's one week out from St. Anthony's Triathlon. I'm doing a thing. I'm going camping with Chris Corbin just for probably like 36 hours, but uh, I woke up this morning. I've got a kind of a hardish ride to do. Yesterday was also a hard ride, and I just felt like I would use this three hour drive to, to keep waking up. Chris is out uh, by Steens Mountain which is the place I wanted to go for a little while now. Uh, there should be an epic gravel ride for tomorrow morning. Today, a pretty long fat max zone two, whatever you want to call it, workout. Uh, but mostly I just want to be out in nature and chill. last week end of training for a race but the schedule is conducive to it and feels like a thing that I got to do but uh, anyway this is gonna this is not a break workout video here this is not all on full-on training session this is uh, me just going to have a good time if this ever hits the internet Give me snake skin boots, go swaying like a noose, and I'll be clinging to the back of this Indian bag. Stop! We're going with the gravel road. Gotta do it. Woo! Brass ring in the center and a wind with the red. Finished off by some Coca Cola flavored. Tailwind. We're gonna do it. The cold Coca Cola flavor out here. It's a vibe. Woo! Feeling good. like this. Come on. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Appreciate it. Much stuff. I went out. I went out of town here and like climbed the hill, and you can make a ride on this thing called like Rock Creek Road. And that's just, I think it's like a gravel road that goes for like 40 miles to the next something. I don't know. And then I went like one mile up. Did you Mountain. see this on the right? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I want to do. That's like yeah. the freaking mega loop, but I assume there's snow up there. Yeah. It goes with like 10,000 feet or something. Yeah. But I'll go up that tomorrow and just see how high I can go. Yeah, man. This is Give me a
I've been trying to figure out how to say this for a while. I don't even want to start, but. This is amazing. This is, this is what triathlon means to me. Got into it in the first place because it was a new thing. A whole bunch of new stuff I could work on. It seemed like I was meeting great people. Self-improvement. I have absolutely loved it. If you're watching this, probably at least half of you are like, oh my gosh, I can't believe he's doing this one week out from a race. But that's increasingly the kind of thing that I said no to my entire career, even though that felt like the thing that I should be doing. And I feel like that's the job component. Triathlon had to make money. I didn't have some fallback thing where I could like continue to float myself without results. So if I didn't make it happen, I was gonna have to go be an electrician or a plumber or something like that. And I realized, I think I've gotten to a place now, professionally, where I have checked off every little goal that I set for myself, that I truly cared about. I didn't make it to the Olympics, I was the first alternate. That might be the one thing, but also I feel like that was a great part of my story. I loved the chase. I was trying to get there so, so much. And the fact that I didn't actually go sucks, but who knows what could have happened at the Olympics that may or may not have enhanced that story, you know, one way or the other, for better or for worse. I think that we're, I, I don't know. I think we're ready for like my version of that triathlon life, which is just three sports in your life think up the coolest thing that you can think of that gets you excited to train and gets you excited to go do it and it can be a race that's fine that's for a lot of people but also it can be a 200 mile triathlon that you and a couple buddies made up like let's not forget that's how Iron Man started three guys in a bar thought up the craziest thing that they could I'd be willing to bet if they were still around they might not be doing triathlon they might have thought up seven other crazy other things and that's where I'm at anyway I'm trying it on for size I'm saying it out loud I want to try a swim run I want to try a 50k trail I want to do stuff like this and feel it's all part of the journey it's all part of the story this is probably never going anywhere it's way too long but that's why I'm out here right now putting all this aerobic nest that I have to use in the ways that I've always secretly wanted to and haven't been able to fully dive into. Taking chances I want up the lines. And I'll